You ready? In just a few short weeks, cicadas, they're going to start to surface all over the tri-state. We are talking about a billion of them. What's a billion amongst friends? Yeah. The area only sees large groups of cicadas called brood 10 every 17 years. You probably remember when they happened mm -hmm. last time. Local 12's Alexa Helwig found out what to expect for you and for your pets. Whether you are fascinated or a nervous wreck, about a billion cicadas will start to emerge around southwest Ohio next month. Dr. Gene Kritsky says the insects will be around for six weeks. There's a fear of the unknown. Uh, some people just don't like bugs. But these are really quite an interesting little group of animals. Uh, they, uh, they're once in a generation when they come out. You'll never forget it. And Dr. Kritsky says you won't forget how loud they are either. The sound of large groups can reach as high as 100 decibels. To put that in perspective, um, Mount St. Joe is on the flight path for, people, for play, jets going into CVG. And uh, those jets usually fly in between 70 and 80. The cicadas will be louder than the, uh, the jets flying overhead. The insects can do a lot of good for the ecosystem. Dr. Kritsky says they also provide nutrients to animals. They're going to have a larger food source than they're to get. That'll increase their populations, and that can actually benefit their predators as well. While cicadas are not harmful to people, veterinarian Dr. Beth Mollison says the level of concern is also low for pets. We do worry if dogs or cats eat a large amount of them. Um, we can worry about things like irritation of the stomach lining from their exoskeleton, so that hard outer shell can irritate their stomach. Dr. Mollison says just be on the lookout for abnormal symptoms. I think overall the pets are probably going to fare better than us. Um, you know, I think a lot of people are are uh, not excited about these. The pets will probably have some fun with them. Alexa Helwig, Local 12 News. Now, Mount St. Joe recently launched an app called Cicada Safari. It'll track cicadas as they emerge next month. It's up to nearly 40,000 downloads. Mm -hmm.